I'll use the end of that black pipe as a reference point here for a while. You can see the water's coming out. You can also see that it soaked the ground <clears throat> all the way past those two big rocks. Uh, but then it breached right just past the end of the pipe. You can see where it breached. And there's a perfect example, though, of what I mean. When it breached, that water ran down that steep rock face, really, is how bad that soil is. It, it's, it's like stone. You can't get a even a pick into it in the summer, but it does soften with water. But anyway, it made a delta <clears throat> when it hit the next Zanja down. And from there, it spread out to the right and to the left. That usually happens. It's more to the right. Uh, and I'll, I'll go down there and I'll show you what that looks like, what it washed down through there, because already you'll probably see the so, uh, sorting out of the soil. Now, let's see what happened with that water. It had to have breached, but I don't see, from here I don't see exactly where. But if it did, it probably, right there, let, let me try zooming. I should zoom anyway so you could get it. Yeah, because it's still running. It just, from this angle, you just don't really see the breach. But you can see below where it's arriving at the next Zanja down. All right, and then finally back here, zoomed in like this, you should be able to see that delta. There's the end of the black pipe and that little bit of water supply, and there's where it breached. I'm going to take the shovel. This is soft enough now where it's uh, sort of soaked into the ground that I can get a little bit out, and I'll shut the breach off. And then I'm going to go down there and show you what it's done. There, I shut the, the breach off, and uh, you can see the water is now beginning to work its way down along there again. Uh, and meanwhile, I'm going to go down there and show you what's happened here. Now, th this has been more complicated because there is a flow going from left to right. It's going across that delta. But now, see, it, it, what it did was it washed the finest of the soil down and left the stone behind. It, I mean, it's very clearly erosion. It must have come with a little bit of force when it breached. But, but but by the time it's caught by the next Zanja down, that's been sorted out. So I'm trying to work one-handed. Here you can see it's real fine, real fine stuff. Now, as I pull that, I'm going to pull it not just up to make the breast higher. I'm going to pull it across to make the breast broader. So I'll do that, and then I'll film it again. So there's where it came from, and now I've hoed that that out. It was, you know, very soft. It was just super soft, and and here it is down here now. And so that soil has been sorted out. I'm not going to say it's wonderful topsoil, but at least it's fine, and and over time it builds up. So here you've got your good soil. There you've got your stony. Uh, wall, if you want, between between the terraces. Now let's, if you take a look out through there, you can see that whole field is done like that. And there's a breach. I can see them from here. Well, let's follow this water down and see and see where it breached down here. It's uh, uh, soon it's easier to walk in the Zanja itself because you're not so likely to fall. It's a level spot. All right, here it is. There's where it breached. Uh, you can see that. And now it's coming harder and faster. And the same thing has happened. You see it It washed the, uh, the fine soil off that stone. I call it stone, but super hard. It, you know what this is? This is a spoil that came out of the bill of my house. Uh, back when my grandfather had it, uh, the inside of the uh, foundation excavated. Uh, they just brought it out and dumped it here, so it's it's just hard subsoil clay. Anyway, right here, same situation. I'm going to just take that 
and and pull it down and across so you don't want the uh, the breast to get ever higher and then and then now see it's going all the way out there to the wheel pit let me try filming from here um, down there uh, well let's see here's that the the highest of the zanjas and, and the water's coming along it's working its way along back to where it was that's the first one I repaired I just repaired one there and here's one starting you see now that that water is coming faster there's one there and there's another one starting there well I'll just take a little bit of a shovel full I, I can't do this with one hand and I'll repair that and I'll repair that and this one must have been going a little bit before because you can see down there there's a little bit of a delta now I'm back up where I started. I repaired that breach and showed and pulled the uh, silt out. And you can see that that second one down is wanting to breach. That's fine. Let it. That's fine. I'll repair it and I'll use the soil below it. And then the water is working its way along. Uh, <clears throat> it's made it to the wheel pit in the third one down. And it would fill that. It probably will before I film this again and the second one is probably going to make it <clears throat> although it looks like it'll breach on its way that's okay